Now let's discuss about the symmetric matrix and skew symmetric matrix. Symmetric matrix is a square matrix. Is a square matrix which satisfies the condition A transpose is equal to A. Skew symmetric matrix is also a square matrix which satisfies the condition A transpose is equal to minus A. Now, here in this, all diagonal elements will be zero. All diagonal elements are zero. Now, how to prove this statement? A, A it is given as A transposes minus A. According to the transpose concept, we have seen that A transpose is nothing but small a j i. All the elements will be in this form. And in normal A matrix, it will be A i j. Now, it is a square matrix. So, for this, i, I will be equal to j. Right? The number of columns and rows will be same. So now you can write it as AII is equal to minus AII. Just bring here, it becomes 2AI will be 0 and AII will be 0. So all the diagonal elements will be 0. Okay. In this question, it says A and B are two symmetric matrices. And we need to show AB is also symmetric if and only if AB is equal to BA. It means like we need to show it means we need to show AB whole transposes AB only because we need to show AB as symmetric matrix. So to show this we can write AB transpose as according to the reversal law. We can write it as B transpose into A transpose. Now, both A and B are symmetric matrices. So, we can write B transpose as B, A transpose as A. Now, it is given as BA is equal to AB. From the question, we can write it as AB. Hence, AB is a symmetric matrix. Now, this question, we need to show B transpose AB is symmetric if A is symmetric and it is Q symmetric if A is Q symmetric. So this depends on A. So case 1 if A is symmetric if A is symmetric which means A transposes A we need to show we need to show that B transpose AB is also symmetric, which means we need to show B transpose AB whole transpose is B transpose AB. How to show this? Now let's write B transpose AB whole transpose. According to the reversal law, we can write it as B transpose A transpose B transpose of whole transpose. Now. Let's write B transpose as B transpose itself. A transpose as A because A is symmetric. And this whole transpose becomes just B. Hence, we have shown this. Now, case 2. Case 2 is A is Q symmetric. A is Q, Q symmetric. Which means A transpose is equal to minus A. Now we need to show that B transpose AB is also skew symmetric by proving this equation. How to do this? Take again B transpose AB whole transpose. Again, according to the reversal law, it becomes B transpose A transpose B transpose ka whole transpose. Now we can write B transpose as same B transpose itself. Now A is Q symmetric, so A transpose become minus A and B transpose whole transpose is minus B. 
So now it is B minus of B transpose A B. Hence, proved. Next question. A and B are symmetric matrices. We need to show A plus B is symmetric and A B minus B is Q symmetric. A and B are Q symmetric. Sorry, A and B are symmetric, which means A transpose is A and B transpose is also B. Now first, how to prove A plus B is symmetric? Take first A plus B transpose. Now according to the properties of transpose, we can write it as A transpose plus B transpose. And from the given, we can write it as A plus B. Hence, proved. Now, second, AB minus BA is Q symmetric. How to prove this? Take first transpose of this. Now, according to the properties, we can write it as AB whole transpose minus BA transpose. Now, according to the reversal law, we can write it as B transpose A transpose. Again, for this, according to reversal law, A transpose B transpose. Now, from the given equation, from the given thing, we can write it as B A minus A B. Now, we can write it as take minus common A B minus B A. Hence, A B minus B A is Q symmetric. Now in this question, it's given as A is symmetric matrix and we need to show A power N is also symmetric. How to show this? Which means we need to finally prove A N whole transpose is A power N. Right. So how to prove this is first take the transpose which is A power N transpose. We can write it as we can write A power N as multiplication of a of n times right t this is n times now take transpose for everything it follows reversal law which means this only a transpose a transpose a transpose a transpose a transpose again these are also n times now a is a symmetric matrix which means a transposes a now write a a into a all a n times again which means a power n hence proved